Hey guys, I know I said I was gonna go to Paradise Lake for my next trip, but here I am at the swamp, aka Triker Pond. It's the closest thing to a swamp we have in Chico. I mean, it's not a swamp, it's a pond technically, but it's gross, scummy, there's trash everywhere. It's right by the freeway, but it has some big bass. And I've actually caught some big bass in here before. So today, I'm gonna try and break my, uh, <laughs> my losing streak and go out there and catch something big. <laughs> So it's really hard to find a spot to fish out here. Um, there used to be some good spots where you kind of hike through this little foresty area to get into, but uh, there's a lot of homeless encampments here now. And I just don't want to try and go through there and walk through someone's, you know, somewhere where someone's living. So I'm just kind of here, right next. The highway's literally right behind me, I'm sure you can hear it. There's this little bike path that goes through here, and I'm just gonna throw, throw my little frog here. See what happens.
gonna go try and see if I can get to my old fishing spot. Um, like I said, there's a lot of homeless encampments and I'm just try not trying to walk through somebody's living area just so I can fish. Um, we'll see though. Shame this area is so polluted because it actually is um, good with filled with a lot of uh, yeah, like big that? fish. Nothing yet, but um, yeah, we got to figure out this uh, homeless issue in Chico. It's a major issue. There's no easy way to go about fixing it, but something's got to happen. So I just got done walking through the uh, little homeless encampment. It's just on all sides of the path, just full of people living there. It's it's honestly pretty sad. I didn't want to film going through there. They're just, you know, people in a tough place. But now, I'm on the other side of the pond, and I'm gonna try and get through all this sludge here. If I can get through that sludge there, then I'll start catching with my frog again. Not used to be this sludgy back here. Oh, I hope this is just mud. <sighs> oh, here we go. It's clear. Good. Might be losing my frog right now. My, my favorite frog move. So I lost the frog. I'm gonna try the only other uh, top water I have. Um, Cause I can't really fish with anything else here. There's just too much stuff to get snagged on. And if I don't catch anything with that after about, I don't know, half hour, I'm probably just gonna pack it in. So I'm changing it up. Going with this little uh, white swim bait. And this little jig head. I think that's what it's called. I don't know, it's kind of weighted hook. Been casting out right in front of these these reeds or whatever this um, kind of algal bloom that's out here. There's a nice little deep pocket between the shore and the algae. Cast in there. So I know I know there's fish in there. I can see them jump.
caught again. Caught on that little stump right there. I give up. That's it for today. So, it's hot, I'm sweaty, I didn't catch anything. I am uh, throwing my shoes away, I'm actually sitting here. And my socks. Because, I don't even want to tell you what I think I was stepping in, but that's just a really gross spot. I don't think I'll ever be fishing there again. Um, I had my good times, I had my memories. But, it is what it is now. Um, I'm definitely going to Paradise Lake for my next shoot. 110% going to Paradise Lake because it's gorgeous up there. It's gorgeous, you can sight fish bluegill up there. They have bass, trout, and I just need to get out of Chico. It's starting to get too hot in Chico. The sack is boring. The swamp is gross as well. So, yeah. I know, I know it wasn't a very exciting video. Um, next time, hopefully, it will be. The uh, anticipation for my first catch builds and builds. So keep watching, stay tuned. I will catch a fish, and you guys will be the first to see.